that I want to talk about is this perfume from Gucci. Um, this is part of the Gucci Flora Collection, and this is the Emerald Gardenia. Now, I didn't want to purchase one this big because I don't know why, but I just, I didn't. But anyway, um, I did keep the box because it's limited edition, and I actually really love this collection. So, I went ahead and picked this up. Um, I picked this up in the biggest one that they made because it was about to, like, it was pretty much sold out. But... This scent, I love it. Um, I'm actually not going to go over the notes or anything like that because I'm going to go over another, well, I'm going to do another video talking about the perfume collection that I have and I will go over all of the top notes, middle notes, things like that and what all of that good stuff means in that video. So, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that I did purchase this. And we're going to talk about it in my next video. So anyway, I have like a box full of stuff over here. So the next product that I did pick up was I picked up this beauty blender. Um, this beauty blender retailed for $20, which is why I purchased it. Um, this one is the makeup sponge. It has a pouch with it. It also comes with a solid charcoal sponge and brush cleanser. And then it has like a little um, scrub mat as well. So... I haven't used it because I said no matter how long it takes, I'm not using this until I talk about it on film. So, standard beauty blender here. Uh, has like a little wet me sign. And then this is the scrubber. I like that it has a little, little thing in the back of here from when you put it back in here for it to get air. And then this is the cleanser the little solid that you rub it on and get it clean. So, yeah, I actually ordered this offline, ordered the perfume offline, and I also ordered two other products that I'm about to talk about. So, let's go ahead and get into those. So, one of those products that I ordered was the new eye cream by Pharmacy. Um, this one is the Brightening Vitamin C Eye Cream with uh, Arceola. I don't know if I did cherry and um it actually let me see it has like a little hint of cherry mine's kind of a little sol solidified because i do keep these in my um refrigerator it just top tier and the other thing that i ordered online was my absolute favorite face cream like if you go to sephora and you are looking for a good face cream. Y'all. And more so on the affordable. Because I want to say this one is $47 maybe. Um, but this one you get 1.6 fluid ounces. And this is the Fresh Vitamin Nectar Moisture Glow Face Cream. I, Y'all. Y'all don't understand how much I love this product and it smells like oranges and I just I'm in love with the whole thing okay this and then I also because I picked this up I went ahead and picked up the vitamin C glow juice antioxidant face serum now this this is not a moisturizer okay but this is just like a little face serum. There has a protection against damaging um, particles and it, anything that may lead to any type of dullness or lackluster in your face. This and this chef's kiss. Um, they also have a um, a face. What is it? It's like a face cream. No, it's a it's a mask, and it's orange, and it kind of has like orange peel pieces in it. I didn't pick that up this time, and I don't know why. Major fumble on my behalf. However, I highly recommend getting everything. Okay, so I'm back. The lights died. Anyways, yeah, highly recommend these two. Top tier. 
And um, I do have the face wash by pharmacy as well. I still had some left, so I didn't pick it up. However, I did pick up another one. So this brand is, I think it's a little bit newer to Sephora, but I've never used it. But this brand is Biosense, Biosense. And this is a squalene and amino aloe gentle cleanser. And it is supposed to deeply cleanse without over drying. And this is a plant, devi plant derived squalene. Um, and it just says mix a little bit with a small amount of water, work into a lather, massage on your face, and then rinse clean. Um, I like that it has like a very it has like a very earthy smell because of the I'm assuming the um plant derived um amino acid mixed with the aloe. But I actually really enjoy this. And then it also came with a squalene and omega repair cream that deeply moisturizes and then they had like a little um like a little lip a little lip thingy and it's supposed to repair and also slowly plump your lips so I actually um it's somewhere around here but I actually um enjoy this face cleanser um I'll link it below as well so yeah and then we have one more skincare product to talk about and I actually wasn't gonna purchase this because I really didn't need another moisturizer but hear me out hear me out hear me out Peter Thomas Roth and it was on half price so this is an originally $65 moisturizer and it was on sale for $23 Come here. Give me that. So, I did go ahead and purchase this. Now, this is the Peter Thomas Ross Water Drench Cloud Cream Hydrating Moisturizer, okay? It says 30% of hyaluronic acid complex draws atmospheric vapor helps lock in hydration for up to 72 hours and it's for all skincare types. Not skincare, skin types. What am I saying? It says, drench your skin with a liquid cloud of pure moisture drawn from the atmosphere this concentrated 30 percent hyaluronic acid complex provides 72 hours of hydration even after cleansing three molecular sizes of hyaluronic acid a potent hydrator that can attract up to a thousand times its water in its weight in water for moisture in the air help replenish the look of the skin to make appearance more supple full and smooth Pro Hyal Plus helps improve hydration for healthier looking skin. The appearance, the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles is visibly reduced, leaving a silky, hydrated, and more youthful looking complexion. Oil free, alcohol free, and fragrance free. For best results, apply twice daily to face and neck for continued with continued use. So I know y'all like, why she reading all that? Because y'all don't. That's why. Because y'all don't read and y'all just purchase and be like, oh, it's a moisturizer. I just, I put it on, whatever. Morning and night. That's what this is supposed to be, okay? Um, For me, I do bounce back and forth between these, but I'm very happy with both of these moisturizer purchases. I will definitely say that, okay? I am completely and utterly satisfied with purchasing both of these i'm glad i did will i purchase this again only if it's on sale because 65 dollars oh that's a lot 65 doll hairs is a lot people so yeah unless this go back on sale i won't purchase this this i will continuously purchase this um i know i'm talking more so about this than about the eye cream but that's because that eye cream is new I used the eye cream that they had before and I loved it but they saw fit to switch it up so we're gonna give them a chance we're gonna see what they talk about and now we're gonna keep on rolling with the skincare so this is from one size by mr. Patrick star and this is the mattifying waterproof setting spray I actually haven't used this I did put on some makeup today not much just a little bit 
and I said I wanted to try it so has a nice smell has a nice smell to show you on that Patrick um, and then I also picked up this foundation powder. Um, this is a versatile foundation powder. Turn up the base. And I got Dark 2 in the shade Neutral. I do. I really enjoy the packaging and the colors that he has put out. I will say that. Now this, I love that it comes with a mirror. And this is definitely my shade. I did put a little bit on today. And... I like it so yeah this he did come out with some concealers that I haven't quite got my hands on yet but they're on the list and then I just picked up a lip liner from Kat Von D in the shade crucifix which is just just a dark brown not the major or excuse me what is it KVD beauty whatever um this now this this has the girls intrigued I'm the girls. This is the Makeup Dissolving Mist. It's called Go Off. I, I'm in love with this. And I will say another thing I do like is that I like that these are different. Like, let the girls know. These are not the same. So, I actually have not tried this yet. But I am very, very anxious to see how this works. It says, it's an epic continuous mist that dissolves makeup on contact. Infused with calm, jojoba, and brightening roast hip oils makeup is dissolved without leaving skin feeling tight or jar our concentrated water-free formula creates a no drip super slick surface for the ultimate makeup removal spray eight to ten inches away from the face until it's evenly coated massage gently into skin and wipe off to remove your full beat face pair with go off juiciest makeup remover wipes I want to say he's about to come out with some new wipes or something because they was all sold out or on sale or something other. But I want to say I do have some makeup wipes by him. So I'm going to try. But this one is in the shade Copper Cider. And it has Make It Rain, Missile, Missile Glow, Rusty Boots, and Figure Pudding. So these are the shades. I love the copper. Like I, I love everything about this. It's just. A cute little holiday, everyday, dark palette. Love it. I can't wait to use it. Now, let me know if y'all want to see a video. Don't let me know because I'm going to do it anyway. Now, this one, to me, this one is more of an everyday vibe. Like, to me, this is for the girls, the Instagram baddies. Like, this, like if you're trying to do the Instagram baddie aesthetic, I felt like this was the one. So, this one has, oh, my dear... It's a wrap, golden ice, and Santa Shack. These are everyday shadows. That's the Sephora um, VIB haul. Thank you guys for watching. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I will link below the J Roller and probably. I'll list all of the products. I may not link them all, but I will at least list all of them to let you guys know what I did purchase. I might link the Gucci perfume because <laughs> he limited edition. Mm -hmm.